You know, I've been sitting here contemplating for the past little while. Okay, contemplation's over. How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. Okay, let's get up and move around. I want to do something with this. I don't know what I want to do with it yet, but... How do I roll this thing again? That one, right? Okay, fine. Just break it, then. I was really hoping I could do something else with it, but nah, nah, I'm just, I'm just gonna break it. Hello? Anyone downstairs at all? Wow. It's just empty. I mean, it's so empty, there are bugs flying around everywhere. I'm. Ah, well, wow. It's so empty that one of these things are here. That's. That's pretty dang empty. <laughs> Hello? Oh, jeez. Yeah. This place is downright abandoned. Hello. I. I. Don't think I approve of this. Hey, buddy. Ha. I'm sorry, bro. You, it's, it's just dumb. Barely make it across that. And everything's blocked off. Okay. What's the point in going in there if there's nothing you can do? Hello? Is anybody in this abandoned ship aside from me? Well, yes, but no. Everybody come at me. I have a plaything. It's called a sword. I, I, I think this, this sword is my plaything. I mean, you can keep trying. It's just not gonna work. I'm literally pressing the right analog stick on my controller to the left the whole time. Almost sounds like me clapping, but with like plastic hands or something. That's not gonna benefit me whatsoever. I, Master, please look. What? Oh, that door. This large door here is sealed shut. The door must lead to an important room in this ship. No, really. I thought that door led to the cookie jar. I mean, that's the most logical place, right? There's there's a ginormous cookie jar within the freaking ship, didn't you know? I, I No one understands why they hid it here. Because it was an abandoned location, they never thought anybody would come here, but... Great. Um... Right, I remember what to do here. So... Okay. Yeah, this, this, this is... This is... Wow. How, how, how long would it take IRL to build up this much dust? How dare you. Get out of my sight. Okay. Where's... 
is number two. Get out of my sight. What did I just see? Okay, number two. So, down, bottom, top, bottom, right. All right. You know what? I'll, I'll let you loot. Just leave me alone. Bottom, top, bottom, right. There we go. It wasn't registering it for some reason. Is the cookie jar here? I much appreciate it if it was. No, just a chest. That that's it. Just 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 a chest. That's all it's in here. With a key. Probably to the mini boss. Let's go. I mean that would be my first instinct. That door that was right next to where we started. The mini boss door. It'd be first instinct for me to go there first. Alright. I remember when I first played this game on the Wii, I struggled so much with this guy. Like, enragement struggle. Struggle. Let's see if it's any different this time. Since I'm doing, again, Weaver, or Switch version. Which probably will make a significant difference now that I'm thinking about it. And run. Could you be any slower, Link? He could. I probably shouldn't ask that. Alright. There's a cookie jar in here. The sugar level in my body is, is level um, brownie, and I want it to be level cookie. Someone stole my cookie jar, and now I have no idea what to do with myself. This could be very problematic. Let's go fight a monster to see if that'll help. Cotton? Hi. Come on, come here. Ah, oh, you're so slow. A second sword. Uh, excuse me. Ow. Hey. No, dude. Yeah, you need you need a better battle strategy. This is what happens when you don't let me look for my cookie jar. I get so mad that I'll just start slicing your arms off. I mean, dude, I'll slice the other arm off easily. See, I, I told you. I told you I would. You just don't listen to me. Have a good night in hell. That might be it. <laughs> it probably isn't, but... Master, that synthetic life form, there is a 99% chance that it was the pirate described by the captain. I can't help but admire the tenacity it has displayed in staying alive and functional all these years. Yeah, even the skeleton should have been turned to dust at this point. Ah, you 
got the ball. That's not a cookie jar. Quite the opposite. That is something I can't eat. I think. It's way too long to be a cookie. Way too thin. Master, a report about the bow you have just obtained. You're right, that is no cookie. Now don't try to eat that. You look ridiculous. You might poke a hole in the back of your throat. <laughs> that that would that would not be fun. Your bow's elasticity can propel arrows through the air with I know how a bow and arrow works. Raise your bow by you can also shoot arrows to strike certain devices in order to activate them. Okay. It will be difficult to target it from here, so I recommend you return to the deck. Fine. Go back to the stinking deck so I can do what you want me to. If I don't get a cookie, then this, I'm gonna go for dark. I could break the barrel, or I could just do this. Just look at my face. I'm getting so annoyed. So abstractly annoyed with that mashuku. That I look like that now. Right. Oops. I did not mean to do that. I think I need to shoot is up there. But I first need to actually have a way to get to it. Oh. Oh. I was gonna say I might have found a way, but no. No. Um. How am I supposed to reach that? Am I stupid? Oh, uh, no, but I am blind. Doink. Ow. Master, I have important information for you. There is a 90% chance the object you see over there is a time shift stone. Is the other 10% that that thing is my cookie jar? Is the game requiring me to shoot my cookie jar with a freaking bow and arrow? This, this is bull. Now I'm getting mad. If that's the sound of anger, then I've got issues. Those of you saying I got issues anyway, I can hear you. Mainly because I'm saying the same thing in my head. If you could deliver an impact to it by some means, it can have signal. Gee, I wonder how I'll do that. I just don't know how this is doable. Holy macaronis. I just don't think this is possible. Oh my gosh, I did it. Uh-oh. Right, that also brings them to life. That's dang fine. Hello? <laughs> Guys, two hits and you're dead. Don't try. Don't try. I mean, come on. Hello? That thing just needs one hit and it's dead. Hey, I got ten arrows. Nice. Oh. I did not need to come up here, did I? Oops. Oh, shut your pie hole. We get it, you're desperate for company while I'm on my way up. But instead of having them come after me, just ask yourself. I mean, 
it's probably the most feasible way of going about it. Right? As far as I know, it is. Buddy, die. Come here. Bye. Hey. Dead. Get out of my sight. Oh. I know what it wants me to do. Uh, hello. I'm gonna shoot the bro. This is how you shoot a bow and arrow. Like that. Let me show your friends. That way they know for future reference. No, it's to mess with somebody with this. A cookie. Bro. What, you thought that blue thing from Sesame Street was the Cookie Monster? Oh, no, no, no. I'm the real Cookie Monster here. Let's go. Actually, if I remember correctly, there's something down there I want. In fact, I'm pretty sure that's a chest at the distance. I'm gonna check there in a sec. Hey, buddy. Guess what? Dead. <laughs> Simple enough. Cause that's not the one I'm looking for, but I think there is a chest down there. <sighs> Let's go! Um, thank you. This is a long endeavor, man. There's still one alive. And not anymore. You know, I'm no more. There, problem solved. That that's it. That's all I have to do. Link, good job, Weed. You're on the ship now. Now the ship looks just like it used to, Weed. That makes me so happy. Now I just need you to go rescue my crew, V. I'm pretty sure they're being held in the brig inside the chip room. It's still pretty dangerous here, so I'll just wait in the boat. You can do it. Why'd you come up here just to say I'm going back? <laughs> what a waste of precious time. You butthole. I could have done without you coming up here just to hear that. Also, I stole some of your cookies from the jar. Ooh, you friggin' cheese. Ow. My goodness. Now I gotta take out a different item. The item swap. Yeah, what I was looking for is down here. Right there. This should be a heart piece. This completes the heart container. And I'm pretty sure three dungeons are after this, so... I think? I don't know. You know what? Fine. That's what I figured would happen. What are you gonna give me? If I just draw a triangle and I've already failed.
Basically, a triangle gets you hearts. Okay. I didn't really need that, but you know. It's not my favorite thing in the world. Still missing it. And it's driving me nuts. Don't mind the stupidity that is me. In fact, I indulge you guys to ignore the stupidity that is me. Okay. Up here. Uh, up here. So. Humor me, why don't you? I believe that boat that had the eye icon that you could shoot bone earth. I think I'm gonna have to shoot that off the bat. So make sure it's lowered when I need it. Pretty sure I will. Now to check out the chest that was over on this side. Is that the last item of the game? What could we possibly be getting otherwise? I don't know. Well, let's see what's on this side first. Then we'll. Oh my gosh. I'm not taking damage. Oh, that's where you fought. Oh. Huh. Interesting. Gonna shoot the eyeball and then go back where I came from. You don't really need to hold it up for very long. <laughs> okay. I wonder if my cookie's down there. And there. Uh-oh. I mean, yes, I wanted it lowered, but I think I made a big mistake. I want it lowered, but I don't want to get on it. Got it. Because when I get to that area, I think... Oh, it's been a while. As of this recording, it's been a while since I played this last, so I don't remember all the details. Anyway, that part done. Let's go back in the door, I guess. The door is locked tight. That's a problem. Fine. Then I'll just go to the door in here. I'll go back where I came from. Hello. Hello. Well, there's another thing in case I need more hearts, but right above it is one of those other things that is... What? I... I don't know. in here. Real life time, I guess. Yo. Come on, guys. Should have learned by now that I was gonna get you. Huh? You? You, but! Trying to hide from me. I will see to it that you fail. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I know what to do. I played the game before. Thank you. Ta-da! And now... I 
think I'm gonna. I don't know. Do I want. That could be helpful. Very much so. Huh. First of all, this. Second of all, I want to check something. I'll be back in a sec. Check the image of the cookie jar because I may have forgotten what that thing is. It's exactly what that thing is. That up there, that, the, the thing up there, that, that thing, that, that, that thing up there, that. That's the cookie jar. That clanging. I'm surprised I haven't broken it. Now, how am I supposed to, I bet I could do it, I bet I could do it, dang it, okay, no, I probably can't do it, it's probably, like, it probably looks like there's an opening, but it's probably like an invisible wall once you trigger this, like, regardless of if you hit the thing or not, it's still going to count as a miss. That'd be kind of funny, though, if you're able to make, hit it in there like that. Look at me wasting a bunch of arrows because I have no damn clue what I'm doing. <laughs> there, got my arrows back. Also, I want my heart back. My heart. There's my heart. Three, two, one, run. Link. That's just... Wow. That's... Wow. Okay, first of all... Dip. That's one door. That probably will be covered up if I don't go in there now. Hey. Still mad. I may not show it as much, but I'm still mad. I have no cookie jar. I can't live without my cookie jar. Wait. Ah. Uh, I see how we how we do. I see how we do. See how we do. I guess these rooms are. I don't care. You know, I I I I I don't. I don't. That door can't be entered in this position. This one can. All right, where does this go? Other than the obvious. Hello. With me. This must not work unless it's. I'm gonna try something. Does that only work? Ooh, that was way too close. Ah, uh, we're going back and forth between this way too much. Watch, just you watch. I'm gonna completely forget what I was even doing by the time we reach next episode. I guess you can't. Uh, hey! Hi, buddy. How did you hit me? How? Thanks! Ta da! Oh, that can't go well. That can't be good. That looks like a machine that just wants to crush me. 
Master, I am detecting very strong vibrations. Signs indicate that activating this mechanism has caused something within the ship to begin moving. Yes, it has. The current situation is difficult to accurately assess, but I suggest hurrying to the crew in the brig and freeing them first. Ah, but I want to finish up all the stuff in here. Pretty sure I have to do that to progress. What's in here? Let's find out. Hi. Ow. You butt! <sighs> what am I gonna do with you? With all of you. Okay. Grab this. Hold this way a bit. That should be enough. Could this go any slower? Uh -huh, I definitely wanted to do that. Called it. I totally called it. I knew I'm gonna. I knew I was gonna want that. Now we can get back here. When. Ever. I think. I think what we want to do now is go back and turn the things off. Maybe. It's going down here. Crew's gonna be in here. Kinda. Hello. a thing. Um, hello? Oh, this guy. Okay, I'm gone. Bye. I think I triggered a secret cussing, kinda. Hi. Getting messages on my phone while trying to finish this up. Come on, guys. This is not out. Dude. That was uncalled for. I was going to say that was uncalled for, but I didn't mind that. Hi. You're a human, aren't you? So how did you get in here, wee? Came with the captain to save us, Weep. I'm so happy, Vaughn. But we can't get out of here while that sparky thing blocks the exit. I noticed. Okay, come on. Okay, I'm getting messages on my phone again. I need to start turning this thing off when I record. I almost forgot to mention it, but the engine room is right below this brig. I know. There's a corridor from the engine room that connects to this brig. I figured that was going to be said. Let's get through the engine room here. You need to activate the two power generators in the engine room. Uh, oh, hey, did you turn on one of the power generators? Still need to activate the other ones. There are two power generators. The last one is here. The one room I haven't been in yet. You can do it, we. Okay, well, I'm, st I'm not showing it, but I am still mad about the cookie jar. I'll never forget it. Never. You can't make me either. I'm just going to take these just because. I don't need them by any means, but I'm going to take them anyway. As compensation for the lost cookie jar. 
that I am probably smashed by now. That thing up there, that's probably just the soul. The soul that was inside of it. Let's see, which room have I not been in yet? This is problematic. Okay. How do I get over there? Hmm. I get it. I know why this is here. Can I still move this up and down even when I'm not? I don't know. I'm frozen in time. Everything just freezes. That happens, and only the only thing allowed to move is that. Ta-da. Now! There we go. I kind of figured I was going to need this at a time, but... When that was the case, I was too incompetent to know. Now that I'm in here, wait. Screw you. Come on, guys. Look, I know I look delectable and delightful, and you probably want to eat me, but it ain't gonna work. And there you have it. We have unlocked. The only thing I gotta do now is activate the thingy that's Gosh, that is really close. How have I not shattered my cookie jar yet? I swear, that's exactly what it looks like. That's not it. What the hell is that? A crystal? Please. There we go. And we should be good to move on. There. And both power generators have been activated, and... Zip a doo doo da day. Let's move over to the other side. Or. What I could do instead is I could hold off on that for next time. It depends on how long. You know what? I'll, get, I'll give this a few more minutes. We're almost through the whole dungeon. So, you know what? Why not? I've already lost my cookie jar, so there's no place complaining or getting frustrated or raging about it anymore. Yeah, because that was total rage. You probably didn't notice, but that was totally rage. Uh-huh. Let's go in here, and... By the way, how many chests are left? Open those. Just those four? Yeah, just those four. Yaman! Uh, let's make it through here. And those four chests can be useful. Oh boy. This can only go so poorly. Or way better than I thought. That, that works too. I want this ladder. I want what's at the top of it. I think it's the four chests that I saw. Yeah. These are literally the only chests that have not been unlocked yet. What's in chest number one? A horn. Looks like a cookie. Chest number two. Silver rupee. Okay. Which means this one's probably a horn, the next one's a silver rupee, and the other one. No, that's an evil crystal. Huh? Isn't it randomized what's in these? Or is this one a horn, the middle one's evil crystal, the other two are silver? Oh, okay, I see the pattern. Oops. Okay. 
All right. Go, 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 go. Oh. Eh. Eh. Well, okay, this one moves faster. That one moves faster. Oh my gosh. Jeez. Okay. All right, so now I have access to this area at any point in time. That was easy. Let's get going. This actually should help me finish up the dungeon part of the dungeon, and we'll do the boss next time. I'm in a hurry game. Come on. I'm not in too much of a rush, but at the same time, yes, I am. Ta -da. Hey, you really came to save us, we? My circuits are glowing with happiness. How is that possible? Really, Vern, you came on board to find Nehru's flame. If you want to reveal Nehru's flame, you're going to have to regain control of this ship. We. The control room is next to the brig. But its huge door is sealed shut, and you'll need a key to open it, Vern. First, you should head to the captain's cabin to the control room. Control room key should be in there, weep. Please take this key as thanks for rescuing us. This key will open the door to the captain's cabin, weep. Okay. You can get to the captain's cabin through a door on the deck in the back. Okay. But I'm getting out of here. Sorry to leave you on your own, but you look like you can handle it. We're counting on you, weep. Okay. Well, I didn't see that coming. I forgot. Uh, you know what? Screw your peep. Hmm. It's easy to get back, though. At least. At least I don't have to go through the whole thing again. Come on. Yeah, you just come out here. We're we're through. We're done. Let's get out of here. I forgot about that locked door. Actually, I know it was there, like up front, obvious a moment ago, but I forgot. Okay. Don't judge my bad skills of remembering crap. You know what? Sure. I pulled out the wrong item. Boom. Now let's go into the captain's cabin, which is literally right there. Don't mind me. I'm just going to go through here. Get to a chest that's down here. To there. Really? Hmm. On second thought, I forgot to do something first. Well then. Uh uh uh. There. I guess that those things are alive, it becomes a problem. Because now everything's just dead. I could save here. But we are close enough to the boss where I might as well just... You piece of... Okay, you know what? Fine. Bad. Really? Die. There are too many of them. That 
That's the cookie. That's what you get. Destroying my cookie. Hey! Dude. Poke you. Oh, the metal thing was. My goodness. What a rude piece of crap. What a ru little rude piece of crap you are. Okay, so close. So close, so close. Let's go. Let's go. Let us go. Ow. Because I gotta figure this out anyway. Ow! Okay. You made me take a great amount of damage. You're gonna regret that. You hear? Boom. And there it is. The key to the boss door, which, holy crap, we have wasted a lot of time trying to get this. The squid, what? All right. Let's head over to the boss door and end the episode there. I sit down and take a chill pill because I'm gonna go crazy if I don't. This jar is broken, I swear it. That's just a cover up to make people think it's not. It's broken! It's broken! Alright, running in here. This is a lengthier episode. Next time might, might not be, I don't know. What? I hope this is the right way. Help. Did I go the right way? Yes, I did. Okay, good. I get lost in this area so easily. Give me arrows. You know, I know heart works too. Here we go. And finally, in the hall of the Mountain King. I mean, the sand shit boss. I'm gonna leave this video here. I'm gonna sit down, take a chill pill, relax, and just hope for the best. Hope that next time we can beat the area. In the meantime, though, yeah, I'm gonna leave this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Legend of Zelda Covered Sword HD. If you liked it, make sure to bring me my cookie jar. That way, please me. And, you know, maybe push the like button because it's so funny you can't see it anymore. If you really like this video, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a Zelda game you'd like to see on here? Let us know in the comments below. Want to check out another one that we've done prior to this? The train is stopped by. I think there are like five others right now. Click the link across my head here and the train will take you there. Or if you miss any of the stops on this right, click the link in the top right hand corner and the train will take you to that destination. But in the meantime, this train's off to its next destination where we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!